Hey you guys, how's it going? Um, welcome back. I cut my hair and everything. I'm just doing a video just to reflect on 2011. I haven't been on here in a while. I'm going to start another YouTube channel next year because YouTube, they're so stupid. They will not let me become partner on this channel because I had some copyrighted something on there. And some I'm not going to say who, who did it, but somebody filed a copyright claim against one of my videos. And anyway, I'm just reflecting on this year. And it's been a like a really long year, like some ups and downs, some really tough po points, some really high points, um, some great moments, you know, that I had like just out of nowhere. Like I remember at one point I was just so low and discouraged in the middle of the year. It was like July, August, something like that. And see, this is how you know who your real friends are. Let me tell you. When you know who you are, your real friends are when you need some money. I'm telling you. When you need some money, I'm telling you. That's when you you know who your real friends are. When your car breaks down, when you you about to lose your stuff, that's when you know who your real friends are, friends are. And friends that I ain't even known that long just stepped up and helped me out like just start driving me around and everything when my car was down because it was just I needed a lot of money, like a lot of money. And God came through like with a check that I didn't even I didn't even know the check was coming and I got a check. I'm just telling you, God is just so amazing. And uh, so a lot of other stuff happened this year. Then I look at like the different things that happened like at the end of the year. Like out of nowhere, like somebody from Kurt Franklin people just called me, well emailed me to interview him. I was like, oh, okay. I thought it was a joke at first. And I interviewed him hosted a TV show, co-produced it for a TV station. They contacted me. I didn't even contact them. Like, God is just, sh like, really on another level. Contacted to do a guest profile on the NAACP website. I didn't contact them. Like, God just shows you that He's in control of everything and every situation. Like, you don't even have to run after folks. God has sent people to bless you, you know? I don't know. Sometimes I just feel, I feel crazy sometimes, you know, because I, like, I have just random jokes that's in my head, like, right now, you know. And another thing, God has taught me about people, about how to deal with people. Because I remember I got in an argument. Well, somebody wanted me to argue with them at church, but I didn't argue with them. And that made them so mad. That made them ten times mad because I didn't argue. If you're not making me money... Or uh, if you're not making me, um, or uh, you not care for me, why should I care for what, about what you say or what you do? You're not making me money. I, I'm not, I don't love money, but I mean, come on. We all need money, you know. But if you're, not, if you're not putting money in my pocket, why should I care about what you say or your argument? That's stupid. So I just walked away. You know, I walked away and they just got so mad. I mean, I just learned that. And I also learned this year... So going back to like mid of the year when I did need some money I learned that God will remove people from your life not just remove people from your life but he will strip everybody away from you so you can go at certain stuff by yourself it seems like it's by yourself but it's really with God to show you that he's going to get the glory out of the stuff out of the what you come out of he's going to get the glory for what you do because you know nobody can say oh well Brian, Brian is this. Brian does this because if it wasn't for me, Brian wouldn't be this. Uh, he wouldn't. Be, can, nobody can say that. And that's. And I remember I would be so discouraged, like especially when I was in college, like an undergrad. I was so discouraged when when I would be doing a lot of stuff, and I just felt like just so unappreciated because I, I just felt unappreciated. But I had to understand that. God did that for a reason. He didn't want anybody else to get credit. Like, nobody can say, oh, well, I taught Brian how to do websites. So, if it wasn't for me, I, oh, I taught Brian how to do public relations stuff. Oh, I taught Brian how to run a video camera. Because nobody can do, say any of that because I ended up teaching myself how to do most of that stuff, stuff by myself. Like, nobody can say, okay, if it wasn't for me, this. And I had, had to understand that. And I got that, like, in the middle of the year, God will strip you of people 
and things to get glory out of your situation so that you'll build a close relationship with him instead of building a relationship with people. You know, I don't have close relationships with people um, enough 